Hey friends, Dave here with Transfer Express, and today we are talking all about shipping t-shirts. So we're gonna chat about how you could package your t-shirts for the lightest weight and lowest price, and then we're gonna touch on some of the features that you should look for when you're shopping around for a shipping service that's going to work for you and your t-shirt business. So are you ready? Let's get ship done. If you are new to Transfer Express, we are the world's largest supplier of custom screen printed and digital heat transfers, heat presses, free customizable designs, wholesale apparel, and expert advice to help grow your t-shirt business. If you haven't already, subscribe. We're kicking out new videos like this one every single week. Now, shipping t-shirts or any other products for your small business doesn't have to be a daunting or complicated task. Sure, with just a couple orders, maybe a trip to the post office or UPS store once a week is perfectly fine, but if your online store or Etsy shop starts pulling in business where you're going to have to be making multiple trips a week or even daily drops to your local post office, you're going to want a simpler and cheaper way to ship. First up, let's talk about how to ship a t-shirt. For shipping anything, you're usually charged based on a few different criteria, weight, size, and how far it's going. So first, to cut down on weight, we wanna use the lightest packaging possible, and for t-shirts, nothing really beats a poly mailer. This one is a 10 by 13 poly bag, which works great for shipping shirts, sweatshirts, and even some smaller hoodies. Maybe an extra large or something, you're going to need a larger bag for. You could fold and slide in a t-shirt right into the bag, maybe even including some stickers or package stuffers like a nice little thank you card. Now, a big aspect to shipping isn't just price, but durability itself in transit. These poly bags are pretty durable, but can be prone to ripping or having holes torn into them. So a lot of businesses choose to double poly bag using a clear poly bag on the inside. So for if any reason the exterior bag rips or gets a hole poked in it, there is an additional layer of defense against moisture or debris getting in to ruin your t-shirt. We ordered these printed poly mailers from Sticker Mule, but there are a few sites out there on the internet that might make more sense price-wise depending on the quantity that you're going to be ordering. Of course, that all matters for you and your business. But now that our t-shirts are packed up and ready to ship, let's talk about some different methods you could use to go about shipping. Of course, all of the major carriers, that's the Postal Service, USPS, UPS, and FedEx, all sell postage online, making it much easier to just go drop off your items at your local drop-off spot. But you'll find the same retail price shipping rates that are online, the same as in person, so it might be saving you time, but not money. If we are all talking about money right now, typically USPS first class package service is the cheapest, lowest cost option for shipping lightweight pieces, say under that pound, like a typical t-shirt. Now, if you're trying to cut down on cost, this is where those third party shipping services really, really come in handy. Now I'm talking about sites like ShipStation, Shippo, Stamps.com, Pirate Ship, and the many others that are out there. The big allure of these services is that you get the bulk buying power and access to commercial discounted rates that uh, your personal volume may never actually qualify for if you're going direct with one of the suppliers. Now, aside from cost savings, these services have quite a few features that you should be looking into when you're comparing each one to find out what's the best for you and your brand. Number one is going to be online store integration. Not only does it simplify shipping tasks for you and allows you to easily print batches of labels, but some of these solutions, like ShipStation, offer branded tracking pages that your customers can access to easily track their orders, making your store and user experience feel and look just like those huge e-commerce retailers that they're used to shopping at. Now these integrations could also automatically update your account dashboards and change the statuses to notify your customer when an order ships. It's super powerful stuff. Number two, be sure to check any monthly fees, shipping markups, and any hidden charges that may be in the fine print when you're selecting your service. Sure, they offer discounted shipping rates, but those costs 
all calculated together each month can balloon your shipping costs back up close to those retail rates you'll get direct from the shipping service themselves. But with simplified and automatic order syncing that you get with all this website integration, many people and small business owners see these expenses as a trade-off that they get for the convenience of having the labels ready to go and print out automatically. Number three, be sure to confirm what carriers they use. Now, you may have a FedEx store, say, right down the street that's super convenient to drop your packages off at. But if that shipping service only ships with USPS and UPS, kind of like stamps.com, it may not make the most sense for you and your business. Of course, now almost all of these shipping services include USPS shipping, which is typically the lowest cost option, like we mentioned earlier, and almost everyone has a local post office by their house or shop. Now, before we wrap this up, we have to mention thermal label printers. If you're shipping any quantity, you should invest in a thermal label printer. Now, the Rolo printers seem to be the most popular right now that we see on TikTok for Etsy shops, creators, and small businesses. And not only does it make printing labels super easy at home or in your business, but we've even seen creators use these printers to print promotional stickers for their brand. With tons of different colored stocks and shapes available in the blank labels themselves, it could work double duty for you and your business and never require any refills on ink or toner. Of course, if you have tips of your own, let us know in the comments section below and be sure you're subscribed here to our Transfer Express YouTube page to stay up to date on all of the t-shirt business tips that we're dropping every single week. Until next time, I'm Dave, happy pressing.